Hey folks, Country Prepper here. Well, I have a new poncho, if you can't tell, and it's raining today, so I have my camera set up in the doorway of the garage so that it'll stay dry, but so I can get out and do this video, kind of do a little bit of a test on this. Just kind of my initial impressions of this uh, uh, poncho. This is made by To-Go Systems. They're breathable outdoor basics poncho. One of the cool things about it is it's actually green, and uh, <laughs> there, uh, if you saw my uh, try my original trifecta video uh, it was white so it was kind of nice this is kind of a Tyvek type material and it's not this one's not reflective on the inside like the trifecta just in case anybody's curious but it can be used kind of like the military style ponchos uh, it does have grommets in the corners so that you could use it to set up an emergency shelter if you ever had to so uh, what's some of the other functions here? It has tie downs for the hood so you can tie it down. It also has Velcro up here and a zipper so that you can zip that up and kind of keep the wind out. It zips down a lot further than that, but kind of keeping it up there right for right now. Uh, has a nice roomy hood. I have a pretty big head, so if I can get my head in it, just about anybody ought to be able to. And uh, I'll step back just a little bit and show you just how big this thing is. You guys can even still see me. So, <laughs> it is a really nice big poncho. It goes down below my knees. I couldn't quite get it all, all of me in frame without adjusting the camera. I'm doing this by myself. I don't have a cameraman. But uh, anyhow, I just kind of wanted to give you guys, and it's, it's raining pretty hard, so... Uh, I'm still dry under here right now, so I'll just kind of uh, uh, wear this out in the yard just a little bit for, I don't know, 20 minutes or so, and I'll come back and report to you how uh, how well it held up. Alright guys, so the rain has slowed down quite a bit, and uh, but I got pretty well soaked out there, or I got rained on a lot out there. I am really, I'm dry as can be on the inside. So I'm going to take this back in the garage, take it off, and uh, and show you a few other features of this thing. Alright, so not only did I stay dry, but I didn't get really hot in this either. And that's one of the things, breathable outdoor basics, Bob Poncho. Um, that's one of the really great features about this. It's a Tyvek material that uh, it's really soft, not like the house wrap stuff. But uh, same stuff that the trifecta is made out of, but it's not reflective on the inside. So... Uh, so you're not going to get hot wearing it, and that's one really great feature that uh, is a huge upgrade to me over the military-style poncho that I have. Uh, underneath that thing, it does not let any air out at all, so you get really hot underneath of there. Another great upgrade over the military-style poncho is this. It has Velcro so that you can close up the hood and uh, you know cinch that down, and then if you use this as a tarp shelter... Um, you know, it's less chance of the rain getting in. I got caught in a storm one time with my military style poncho before I got the tarp that I carry with me now most of the time. Um, so that I have both anyway. But I don't use the, the uh, I don't use the poncho as a shelter anymore because, uh, you can cinch that hood up just tight as it'll go, wrap the cord around it, just, you know, tighten it up just as much as you can. If there's a heavy downpour or uh, a lot of wind, uh, you're still going to get rain coming through that, or at least some water coming through that. So uh, I think that'll help alleviate that problem. Uh, the other thing that I want to show you here is this is plenty big to wear a backpack underneath of, but if you're not wearing a backpack, it has these Velcro patches here. It has two sets of them so that you can hook it together and kind of tighten it up a little bit so you don't have so much stuff hanging out there. So I am really impressed with this, really happy with it. Uh, it does have really good taped seams. Here, I'm blocking out my light. But uh, the seams are taped everywhere you look. And yeah, it's just good construction. It's lightweight, comes with a nice uh, stuff sack. It's not stretchy, so you gotta watch how you fold it. You don't wanna try to jam it in there. But uh, yeah, I'm pretty happy with it. I'm going to go out and uh, set it up as a shelter in another video and show you guys how it works for that. Uh, I'll hook two of them together. Me and my wife both have one in our bug out bags. So I'll take both of them, hook them together, and show them being used as a shelter. I'll do, I'll do one and then two of them hooked together. 
uh, and show you both shelter configurations that way. But uh, that's for another video. Today I just wanted to, while it was raining, I uh, wanted to get, get out there real quick and uh, do a little bit of a rain test on it. So it passed out with flying colors. So that's it for today, guys. Uh, go check out all the links in the description box below. I have quite a few things from To Go Systems coming up. Uh, that company, just they just have a lot of great gear. So uh, I, I really like working with them. So that's it for today, guys. Thanks for watching. See you next time.